and this is Brennan with Sons of Speed and today we're at Black Hawk Farms in South Beloit, Illinois and we are testing out DBA's brand new line of track pads called the XP Plus 735 and if you don't know who DBA is, DBA has been making rotors for over 40 years, great track rotors. The T3 line is just a tried and true track lineup of brake rotors. But this is their first foray into brake pads. And what we wanted to find out is how does it match up? driving a 2017 Grand Sport. This car has been around the track with other uh, track pads, specifically the Raybestos ST43s, and it, it did really well with the Raybestos pads. There was no fade whatsoever. It was, we were able to go way deep into turns and never had a hint of fade all day long. Flush the fluid with Castrol SRF. Uh, the car is in uh, track alignment. But otherwise it's stock. So stock rotors, even though DBA recommends you use the T3 rotor with the 735 pad, uh, it's very similar to the stock iron Grand Sport rotors. So that's what we're running right now. Now these are pre-bedded pads. So what DBA says is that means you don't really have to do a extended bed in procedure. So a couple of 30 to 5 stops is pretty much all you need to get the pads bedded in with the rotors. So we're going to go ahead and do that now. Right out of the box you get an excellent pad bite. And that's what I like in a brake pad. I like the initial bite just to be perfect, just to be crisp and hard. I don't like a lot of pedal trim. And so, this bite is excellent. In fact, if you look at the PDR video from the Corvette, the red brake indicator isn't an indicator of how hard you're pressing the brakes, it's how far the brake pedal is traveling. The pedal travel is very little, which is exactly how I like it set up at the track. And these pads really work well with that style of driving. So if you like a lot of modulation and a lot of pedal travel, in your brakes. These are probably not the pads for you, but for everybody else who really appreciates and enjoys a uh, very little pedal travel, I think that you're going to really like these. So what we're going to try and do is get deep into turns here and really try to fade these as much as possible and see if we can. Blackhawk is a very tough track for brake pads because there's not a lot of cooling zones. And so far so good, I'm getting no fade whatsoever.
location. Excellent, excellent track pad. Has great initial bite, good modulation, great resistance to fade, and the price point is actually very good compared to its competition. So you can't go wrong with the DBA XP Plus 735 pads. All right, thanks for watching, and don't forget to click that subscribe button right there. And check out the rest of our channel for more great videos.